why did you choose to become a PA? And did going to PA school influence that decision or that desire to become a PA even more? Similar to many others, I had that very classic like med school mindset. I only knew that if you wanted to go to medical school, it was as an MD. I didn't know that PAs even existed. Um, but really, I was having a chat with my thesis professor in fourth year, and she is a pediatrician at McMaster's Children's Hospital. So we were kind of just talking about, you know, what I wanted out of medicine, you know, what were my goals, my aspirations. And she kind of looked at me and she goes, have you ever thought about being like a PA? And I said, what's that? So I, she actually set me up to speak with an old student of hers who is also a PA now. And we got coffee and she just got to tell me about her role, the idea of lateral mobility, which is the ability to work in a profession in one specialty as a PA, and then the ability to apply to another specialty without having to do any schooling in between to kind of close the gap. You can just apply to jobs in one specialty or another. And so that really appealed to me. And as well, I really loved the idea of being a part of a profession that just had advocacy at the forefront of it. Being a PA is kind of a new and evolving role and not many people know about it. And I love the idea of being an advocate, not only for my patients, but also being an advocate for the changing healthcare system. And I think once I started school, like PA school now, it's just instilled that love for the profession even more because I'm full of a class of 23 passionate, like they're so motivational and so inspiring that it just, it makes me so excited to get to work with people like this in medicine. So definitely starting the PA program has made me want to be a PA even more. So super similar to Tony, I was also on kind of a classic MD route. I had gone to university to study biomed and I really had no idea um, what the options were in terms of like what I could do with my undergrad. And so, you know, first and second year, I was surrounded by all these uh, pre-meds um, and, you know, we were kind of all on the same route. We were all kind of checking little boxes that we thought we had to, to go to medical school. But then when it finally came down to, you know, like writing the MCAT and getting really serious about it, I had to kind of take a step back and almost ask myself, you know, like, what are my goals and aspirations, almost similar to what Tony was saying, um, and kind of, you know, think about what I wanted. Um, and that's when I kind of realized that the MD profession really wasn't for me, um, just in terms of like length of time um, in school and, you know, like the steps they had to take um, in order to get there. And so I started doing my own research. I looked into a ton of different jobs in the healthcare profession and I did a lot of shadowing. Um, I talk about this all the time on my Instagram. I shadowed so many different healthcare professions. I can't even name them all. And I finally got to shadow a PA and that's really where I learned about the profession. And I fell in love immediately. I don't even think I was like a few hours in before I was like, yep, this is what I want to do. I loved um, watching her kind of um, interact with her patients and she had such a good relationship with them. Um, and then talking to her, you know, one-on-one -on -one later and just learning more about, again, advocacy and how new the profession was um, and how we were kind of working to close off a lot of barriers, um, bring access to, uh, to healthcare to individuals who don't have it and to areas that don't have that access. And so I loved everything the profession stood for and I loved everything that we were able to do. Again, like Tony was saying, within like a shorter amount of time and again, being able to move different specialties. Like for me, it kind of checked off all my boxes, which was incredible. And so I couldn't wait to apply. And then when I finally got to PA school, I didn't realize how big the advocacy was gonna be. Like I had seen the Instagram accounts and I had, you know, and I've seen your blog and I read all your Instagram posts, but I didn't realize how many PAs there were that were advocating for this profession. And I didn't realize how like big the community was. It just made me even more excited. And just like Tony said, each and every one of our classmates just in our year is so passionate to be here. And so it's just incredible to see. It's made me love the profession even more and it makes me so excited to get out there and practice one day.